so I'm about to give you guys another video. So something interesting happened yesterday. I had this is something I was supposed to tell you guys in a separate video about. I have a pond that I've made and it's not the cutest right now because the plants haven't grown in that I planted around it. But yeah. Anywho, I caught two frogs mating in here. And so you know what they gave us? Eggs, yeah. But apparently they weren't frogs. They were toads. I just couldn't get a good look at them, but now I know. But cool either way. So I'm just gonna collect them and we'll watch them grow. So this is my pond. You can see there's some little plants starting to grow around. Yeah. Anywho, I have a container that I used to use for a fish tank. It is one of those little drink things, but yeah, works. It does, I promise. And my dog, who's always trying to mess things up. <clears throat> now, can you guys see them yet? Yeah. They are this little stringy thing in the water. That is all of them. So yeah. I will be releasing these guys back in here once when they do hatch. I'm just hoping to get them to hatch faster this way because when they are in warmer water, they hatch faster. And temperature here is kind of iffy. Switching us. It likes to switch up on us over here. So I'm just gonna put a little bit of water in here. They don't need too much. I'm gonna set this in here so that the dog doesn't get to it. Uh, just let me scoop them over this way first. Actually, take my shoe off. I did watch some videos on some other people doing this, so got some education on it before I did it. Sorry about camera angle going everywhere. I'm putting this with one hand. Probably will need to here in a moment. Here's all of them piled up. And I'm gonna put the phone down to put them in here. Okay, so we are back in the house. And these are all the babies. And they're a Probably not even really a day old as of yet, because they were, I think they were laid yesterday. So, I'm just going to tell you a little bit of what I found out. Okay, so apparently, do you see any white eggs? I know I seen some when I was picking them up. Okay, I see some. Oops. See those with like the little white caps on them? Those are infertile eggs or whatever. And eggs with like fungus on them basically. So those will eventually die. Yeah. Just realized I got some freaking mosquito larvae in here.
Yeah. That sucks. Okay. Those fish are not doing their job out there. Anywho. I'll be sure to keep you guys updated on what happens to these guys. So this is day two. The eggs are starting to form and like separate a little bit into their shape, I guess. So this is day three and the tadpoles have started to come out of their eggs and this is supposed to be their most delicate stage right now. So I'm just gonna leave them alone. This is the stage where they just sit there basically and eat off their yolk sac. Hey guys, back again. And some bad news, I'm outside right now, but some bad news is the tadpoles I had did not survive. Cause I, what happened was that I, they were hatching within three days basically because they were in warmer water. And basically on day one, water was clear and everything, it was fine. Day two, that's when they started coming up and out of there. Water still looked fine. Day three, water was looking a little like murky and everything. And I was just like, I didn't know what to do because the video that I had watched has said that that was their most delicate state, basically where you're supposed to really leave them alone is when they come out of their things and they're like, they come out of their eggs and they are basically little worms. So I decided to leave them alone until the next day where I was gonna take them out. And I was hoping they were gonna be ready. But the next day, looked in there and they were all dead. So, lesson learned here. And the good thing is, even though I guess I thought I took all the eggs, I guess I didn't because in this pond there are thousands of tadpoles. I'm not really sure if they're the toad tadpoles. They might be or they could be the bullfrog tadpoles because there is also a bullfrog here. So let me show you. Bullfrog. The water is very murky right now because my dog had pulled a little pump out of there. So I have to put that back in. Hopefully we're still down by tomorrow. But I'm gonna show you the tadpoles. All right there. All hanging on the side of there. Hanging on the side of there. So yeah, I did end up putting lettuce in here just in case there was not anything on the bottom to eat. So hopefully we will do a okay. Let's see what you want to Yep. <laughs> okay, so I'll keep you guys updated on them. If you like this video, please subscribe. Um, comment down below what you think and any like um, information you think I could use. And that's it. I'll see you guys later.